Welcome to Minecraft. And welcome back to Coffee Pot. Let's brew. Minecraft edition. <laughs> of course. Let's play Minecraft. Minecraft with Link. <laughs> yeah. Not We've been gone a bit. <laughs> I created a spawn. Yeah, someone had a baby. Uh... <laughs> I went to the deepest, darkest realms of mountains and, well, I forgot love... a ton of shit that I did, but I'm sure I'll remember it over time as stories. I love how I have an interesting reason. Trent's probably just like, oh, I sat around and played video games. But yeah, I, uh, I actually had to lead these people as the Messiah. See, this is actually a story about me and what I did while you were away. Uh, huh. Hey, he looks like me, just, you know. He does not look like uh, you. About four feet shorter and more cartoony. No, he and doesn't look like you. He's adorable. You look like Shaggy. It's because I have the beard. No, you look literally like Shaggy. I will never... Not no, see that. No, no. Don't believe him. I do not look like that. Well, don't worry. I look like Shrek with hair, so. <laughs> Shaggy and Shrek plays. Come on, Shaggy! Let's not start a new hashtag, please. <laughs> so, what are we playing? Because I don't think this is Minecraft. <laughs> Shraggy plays. Um. <laughs> we are playing. Actually, fuck it. We'll wait for the title screen. Oh, that theme song, man. The, I'll tell you right now, this is the series of games I was playing when everybody was like, Ooh, Final Fantasy. And I don't think you, you haven't actually played a Dragon Quest game, have you? I'm uh, pretty sure I have, but not enough that I remember most of it. It was immediately replaced with, like, uh, Mario Kart and everything, because I could play with my siblings who were always complaining. Because we only had one TV, one uh, play system, and no uh, memory drives for any of them. This Mem is as far as you've gotten? You didn't I even get to Chapter 3? I didn't do much, alright? I played, and then you beat it, and you spoiled the ending, and then I got bored. I didn't even spoil the ending. Yeah, you did. You spoiled an ending, which I believe is the true ending, and ah, uh, no, it's Medusa. Actually, I didn't spoil the ending. I purposely gave you a wrong one. I also said Medusa when I meant Ursula. <laughs> no, it's Dragon Lord. No, uh, I got this, I got this. <clears throat> so thou art come before me at last. I am the Dragon Lord, Master of Masters, King of Kings. <laughs> I can't wait to watch you read this whole damn thing with that voice. Shit, I'm committed. Long have I awaited this moment. Come, take thy rightful place at my side. Do so, and I shall grant unto thee dominion over half this world. It's a good deal. As the person who's beaten this game, you don't know how funny that is yet. Thou wishest not for half the world? Are you... Are you... Are you retarded? <laughs> Will thou not reconsider? T Tis an offer few would refuse. Seriously. Like, what the shit? <laughs> I gotta... Hang on, I need to check the Monopoly board. What else can I trade? <laughs> Do we have a D? Hold on one second, I think your cord's flubbing. You still have to get a new TV, bruh. Oh, yeah. What if I give you Boardwalk and half the world? How about that? It's a nice vacation spot. Oh, yeah, your name is Shinra, isn't it? You build Shinra Corp! I don't get it. <laughs> Never played seven? Seven. 
Final Fantasy Seven? Oh, uh, no. Yeah, like the main leader of the fucking thing that makes the whole corporation that fucks everything up in Midgar is called Shinra. Poop. You run Shinra Power Company. This is what happened after he was defeated and banished. <laughs> this is why the builder didn't wake up in time. I would read the... Oh, shoot. Wait. I would read the parts for that, but uh, I already know the goddess is female. And I'm not going to do it. But yeah. We just get started. And I have... Oh, shit. You want to take this? Take what? Fuck it, I'll do it. Do you remember who you are? Do you remember what you are? Oh, you were asking if you wanted me to say the line. I see. So you have no recollection of before. No matter. Indeed, perhaps it is for the best. Shinra, you shitbag of Sh Shinra Corp. <laughs> After so long a slumber, no doubt your body will still be weak. Arise, my child, and see that you can move freely. <laughs> Let's get moving! Use the left stick to move around, and circle to jump! I don't think you have to read that. That's... Have a run around and stretch your legs! That, Actu that's not a dia... See? Zelda. Ugh. I prefer a slightly sideways view. Hey, all I'm saying is... Well, Zelda would kind of have a little lead back, but yeah. Thank goodness. All seems to be well. Yes, you can jump. You can fulfill your role. <laughs> I can jump! I can fight! No, no, you're actually not fighting, you're building. I d we'll get into that later, but calm down. Oh yeah, that's like my favorite thing in the entire game. <clears throat> Shinra, my child. I have woken you so that you might perform a vital task. Actually, Go build houses! <laughs> I actually thought about it. We could have just went and made a new character. Fuck it, we're good. Meh. Nah. A task upon which the fate of this very world may... What? I do not doubt that you might feel a little poorly, but it is not the fate of the world more important than... But I'm hungry! Oh, my poor child, it is true. You are nearly at death's door. It seems your lengthy slumber has robbed you of your strength. <laughs> Eat these scraps of paper. Here, my child, take these white petals. You can use them to restore vitality. God damn it, stop trying to teach me how to craft and let me go build shit. I think I greatly sympathize with the hero in this game. Good. Shinra, you have been blessed with a special power. The power to combine blah 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 craft. Go slam them things you together on the workbench and make some healing poop. <laughs> yeah, I like the story for this is... Literally... Humanity has lost their ability to create. Yeah, like, that's, like, the best thing to do. If you're, like, such a villain that you can, like, cause, like, just a change in the entire world, like, a genie's wish, he didn't wish for, like, humanity to be wiped out. He wished for them to not be able to do anything. Like, they can't build weapons anymore. They lost all their imagination and creativity, and he just conquered them when they couldn't make weapons. Couldn't make weapons, couldn't build houses... <laughs> Couldn't yeah. make a little tree fort. Yeah, literally. Rob them of all common sense. Kind of like these days. Shinra, my child. You have the power... Sh the Shared power by, by none. none. The Shared by none. Well, fuck it. You do it then. <clears throat> my throat's starting to hurt. You have anyway. the power shared by none other in this world. I should be a voice actor. Hashtag do it. <laughs> do it! <laughs> no. Just do it. Shall I do it? Anyway. I'm sure that's taken already. Probably. <laughs> I'm just gonna save my voice for the evil guy. I'll just read this. <laughs> now use the healing cream you created to tend to your wounds. Press the square button, bitch. <laughs> Press these and do things. Go. Cool. Om nom nom nom. Well done. You're not dead. <laughs> That happens when you eat the glue. See, kids, all you have to do is listen to that voice in your head telling you to eat these leaves. Good things will happen. Especially if they're multicolored. <laughs> if you're lucky, 
you'll have marvelous adventures. <laughs> yeah, you see that them take leaves? place all in your imagination. See them leaves? You just make a cream out of them, swallow them, go on fucking wizardly adventures. Well, yes, I understand you want to leave, but first you must learn your... <laughs> see, I love this because the hero is just as anxious to get out of this tutorial bullshit as I am. Very well. Show you how to build a path out, which is... Here, take this stick. <laughs> Here, have this shitty stick. It's dangerous to go alone. Take a stick. Here's a stick. Now go make a stick with it. You know... It... I'm sure there's, like, some monster weapons out there you could just, like, grant me if you have the power to just make a stick pop out of thin air. <laughs> Seriously, just... Get one of their weapons. Bring Actually, that's revealed later that she like doesn't have. I think the cat's dying. Let me check on her. Uh. Okay, you get behind my bed, then you just start throwing a hissy fit. <laughs> it's the return of the mascot kitten, and it's lost behind Trent's bed. This is hilarious. Come here. Come here. <laughs> Don't just. Your attention. She's not even like playing. She's just sitting there watching me try to reach. Okay. So it's trying to show me how to do equip. Equipment. There we go. I've been hanging around Chobi. <laughs> He's been teaching you ways to try and get attention whenever we're in company. Get at Right here, three, four. <laughs> Shinra, you're not asleep, are you? But I'm bored. Yeah. I know. I Hitch. just woke up, Mom. I want to go play. Let me go outside. You just gave me a stick. I want to go hit things with it. <laughs> but I'm bored. Somehow I have the power to completely destroy Earth with a stick. Yet somehow I am not. Oh my god, I know how fighter. to get out of here. Let me just do it. Well, you may know, but the audience doesn't. Do you, audience? Hey, dead people. Yeah, bones! Examine. Someone is. Thanks, game, for giving us illegible writing that we can't read. Yeah, see, I actually like this game way... Like, even though it takes a lot of Minecraft aspects, I love it way more than Minecraft. Each one has its perks. Minecraft, you can make a lot more than you can here, but this has that whole... No, I've... Well, I've... this actually has a story. That's... Put it like that. I've broken a... I've messed with a good bit on the uh, Terra Incognita. Well, I've seen a lot. Like, I saw a ton of, like, Mario and Luigi stuff that someone just made. I saw a Mega Man game. <laughs> I'm thinking of a... I think one of the things I tried doing was I remade a... a I went and remade an entire Zelda dungeon in this game. Like, a Zelda 1 dungeon. Okay, you have too much time. It didn't take long, honestly. Especially since you don't have to dig a block at a time. That's something I get sick of in Minecraft. Like, there's no just, like, let me just punch forward and cut a 3x3 uh, three three hole in a wall or something. Unless you use dynamite. and Good lord, you can't use dynamite without freaking people out. The only thing I hated was whenever I tried to renovate a room on here. Oh, yeah. If nothing else, remember this. You're not a hero. Yeah. The entire point is you're not supposed to be the hero to save the world. You're supposed to save the world. Use the power of building for good. Help all these people. Just know you're not a hero. Don't let it go to your head. Oh, no. You wait till you play, la play later You on. are a peasant. The thing is, hero is actually a, like a, a status. 
So, unlike a hero, I don't actually level up. Only heroes level up. The hero has the power to get stronger with every monster he defeats. You're not a hero, so... Good luck to you. Now go turn that pigsty over there into a thriving civilization. Yep, we get to go make a house. <laughs> go make haste for the pillar of light. I obtain a banner of hope. Ow! Forgot about fall damage. <laughs> you obtain two broken legs. <laughs> Pretty much, yes. And a handful of grassy leaves. <laughs> it's a good thing they taught me how to make the healing cream. Which you will abuse later in this game. Like, outright abuse of that stuff. Look, food! We will survive! Never make that pitch of voice in my ear again. I will hit you with we their will own survive. Actually, now I just want to hear you do that. Go ahead, make a song in that tone of voice. No. <laughs> Excuse me, I do. I we really do need to gather a couple of these because Lord knows you're I going to be sent on quests to get them anyway. That and plus, I am a clumsy fuck. I have a bad habit of just taking dumb damage because I'm like, oh, what's this way? Walk right off a cliff. The builder is dead. What do we do? How did he die? He doesn't know how to swim. What a dumbass. Humanity forgot how to build, but we remembered how to swim. Yeah, you, you don't really get the ability to call this guy a dumbass when everyone forgot how to make a bit mashed potato. A warm, soothing light spreads all around. Welcome to your first town. Yay. Sanctuary. Look, someone's here already. Like they were already living here. Probably behind that rock because they didn't realize they could live between the walls of any of these places. <laughs> My name is Peepa. Who are you? Where did you come from? A hole in the wall. You don't remember? The goddess told you to come here? So you got amnesia and you're hearing voices. That's not suspicious in the slightest. God, I love how people just treat you like shit in these games. Well, they have a point. Rebuilding this city must be to house those who join you in living here. Dilapidated house? Save the door. Re repair it by... Yeah. Fill it with dirt. But don't worry about a ceiling. You never need a ceiling. Just make walls. You only need a ceiling if you're gonna go. Uh, if you're gonna add another room on the top. I always made ceilings because it didn't feel right without one. Yeah, same here. Ah, I keep trying to use triggers and it don't work. Why do you do things? Not enough space. Not enough space. Yay. Let me trim the carpet. That's incredible. You fixed, fixed it, with it with dirt? Voices in his hand, but you completely fixed the broken down old house. Some some kind of special power. Yeah, I put dirt everywhere. I got white petals. Yay. I usually survive just by eating the roots. Because I don't even know how to make, like, soup or cook. What does build mean? <laughs> Can we build it? Fuck no! Long ago, the people of this land lost the power of creation. Your duty is to help them regain this power. Here's an instruction manual. Now take this stick and go make a stick with it. Uh, what does make mean? Exactly, I don't think I'm understanding. I think I would stab like everybody who lived here. Some Mason's workstations you can use to build a torch. I'm gonna go make a fire. How convenient. 
just a mason's workbench in perfect pristine condition yeah in, in a world where building does not exist <laughs> left to the elements we it even has a graph table a ruler i think i saw a screwdriver yeah tools and everything but how how build you didn't work. find it you built it <sighs> hmm. Just give me my stuff. She's basically marveling in the fact that I put a bunch of shit on a stick and lit it on fire. That's incredible! I just realized something. You never told me your name. I don't have one. Shinra? <laughs> what kind of name is that? It doesn't sound like you have any special powers at all. Well, fuck you. Tell that to the goddess. The voice in my head. <laughs> she says I'm special. Do you have a voice in your head telling you you're special? No, that's what I thought. Bitch. Come back when you're at my level. None of space. You Yay. build an empty room. Yay! Not considered a room until you put in a light source. Brilliant, now that's all lit up, it's the perfect room! You're amazing, Shinra! You really do have special powers. Put shit on a stick and light it on fire. It's hard to believe that someone who looks so dopey could be so talented. How dare. But you can't judge someone by their appearance, right? Anyway, thanks, now we have somewhere to live. This is important. Those fucking things are the only way to raise your HP. Yeah, I don't know why, but I decided to save them as, like, emergency health potions. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so around the beginning when things were starting to one-shot me, I'm like, Ugh, I can't win. I think I read it wrong, and I thought it said it temporarily raises my maximum health. That's silly. Hey, Shinra, thanks to you, we have such a lovely room. But don't you think it would be much better if we had something to sleep on at night? Whatever do you mean? I know, maybe you could build a thing. Why don't you just sleep on that bush you're standing on? It looks comfy. I mean... That'd be great. I can actually sleep anywhere, personally. If we make two beds, we could sleep next to each other. You're insinuating a lot of shit here, lady. It's like, uh, yeah, I don't know how to make this straw mattress she keeps going on about. That's all you. Go for it. I figured it out. Uh, good job. Clap. All right. Get back to work. Stick. Stick. Pedal. But Brian, why aren't you hitting the tree to get more sticks? You can't break trees with a shitty cypress stick. That's not Minecraft. I bet I could do it. <laughs> You're just not trying hard enough. Go hit that tree. Trent, go punch a tree in real life and tell me how effective that is. Hit the tree. Do it. There. That's not realistic. What is this, petrified wood? I, could... I can't tell if you're trolling or if you're... I am speaking for the audience. Dude, our audience ain't that stupid. I hope. I don't know, we usually only get seven people. I've wondered if it's like one person that keeps trying to buffer the video. <laughs> and it finally, after seven times, gives up. Either that or it finally just loads. And it's like, oh. Eh, it looks interesting. Cuts it off. It's one. Two. Yay! I mean, you know, you could just share a bed. No? No. Alright. Fuck me and my ideas. 
Yes, 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 very much so. Yay, basic bedroom! Woot woot! Well, you built us something to sleep on. Thank you. Whether it's night or day, you can sleep in any bed that is within a room to recover your health. As the sun set, darkness will close around you and more powerful monsters emerge in force. When night falls, you would do well to return to your base, rest upon your head upon a pillow, and sleep until morning. Yeah, monsters don't come out in force. You get this one ghost thing that can teleport to you and just punch you in the face. And it just spawns every, like, minute. Yeah, I like how they'll just spawn in my house. Happened a few times. It's like, teleport. Surprise, motherfucker. And then it'll run away when I hit it. <laughs> then I'll find it on the outskirts of the city, trying to run through a wall. You begin to feel time pass. Yeah, until you do this, time in the day will not go. So for all you pro strat peoples, go get a ton of shit before this point. <laughs> plumberries. Can you give me some plumberries for me? Aww. See? Quest already complete. Yeah, that's why I just loot shit as I'm walking around. Yes, I am starving. Yeah, basically your startup, your uh, rebirth power starts to give, go away. So now you have a hunger bar, too. You're no longer a zombie. Time begins to move again. Only in this square. Oh, now she's trying to make me to build a box. Quit scratching, cat. Goddamn people. Friend is wise indeed. Having a place to store your resources is blah 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 blah. Fuck off. Bing. We made a box. Uh, your friend is smart. She's giving you all these ideas, but she can't put pen to paper. Many would call this plagiarism. I call this... Hmm. Ryan, yes. give me big words that mean things. Uh... Uh, flagellate? I don't know if that's... Right or not, so I'm not gonna use that. If you're wondering what I'm doing, I'm leveling shit. Just not your character. Wait, wait, wait. Oh no, you broke it. Well, I have to get my house started. This is always the building I, building I pick for myself. Because no matter what, the NPCs will move in and immediately steal my bed. Yeah, you don't get to make your own specific room till a little bit later. I like how it takes like how long would you say? A uh, few months their time, maybe? Until they're like, yeah, um, I'd like some privacy. I'm literally living in a building with nothing but men, and I'm the only girl. <laughs> Starting to feel eyes on me occasionally. <laughs> Getting a little nervous. You know the funny thing is, this game's actually way more tame, but like... A lot of Dragon Quest games are not afraid to go into the area of, oh hey, she got some legs. <laughs> You're dumb. But like, in the one for DS that I've been messing with, you get Jessica, and like, her main stat for her character is sex appeal. Where she can charm monsters and shit. 
Interesting. But like, she gets a bunch of whip moves and stuff with that. It's really weird. But they aren't afraid to play with it. Okay, so this has been a good 30 minute episode actually. It's nice to be back. Yeah. We so, built a dirt wall. <laughs> told this girl she was dumb. And listened to whatever the voice in our head said. Then we told it to fuck off, because we were hungry. <laughs> Don't fuck you off. tell me not to eat. Fuck off, we want to go play. But I only get a few voice scenes. I don't actually have any cinematic moments. Uh, you broke it again. Oh, there we go. Anyway, this has been Coffee Pot Let's Brew of Dragon Quest Builder. Because we bought this and fuck it, we're gonna do something with it. It's not bad. Yeah, it really isn't. And we'll see you guys next time. Or will we? Maybe it'll be next year.